Hello everyone and welcome to Jumperman Tech where we specialize in HVAC, we do everything DIY and today we have a service call for this fan call unit all the way up top. Thank you to everyone tuning in to Jumperman Tech. We have a service call for this fan call unit all the way up top. What a weird location guys thermostats on the wall there okay let's climb up here this is really high up guys seriously how do we even get to this thing okay if you look on the right you see a filter poking out on the bottom it's like a little white cardboard looking thing and it says june 10th 2022 that filter was last changed jesus about to be in 2026 guys this thing never ran for a long time that's the return right up against this duct right here on the right. That's crazy. And then the supply is over there and it just goes right into the wall. I mean, could I at least try to duck this thing down a bit? This thing just blows right onto the wall. Is there even space to make a turn on that? Oh no. Anyways. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. This is interesting. All right, let's take a peek at this thermostat. <laughs> it gets better, guys. Where's the screen? Where's the buttons? The board is there. Somebody just ripped the freaking screen off. I bet you it's not even mounted. Oops. What the? What the heck? Wait a minute. Yeah, it's, it's... What the heck? Who did that? <laughs> Alright, let's see. We only got three wires here. Let's see, can I put this here? I don't know. Got three wires here. What the heck? What the heck happened here? Alright, we got W, C, and R. We got our 24 volts. R, C will be the common to complete the loop. And W is heat. Is there any power here? Probably not. All right, hung this back up real quick, real easy. Uh, I got my meter here set to voltage, AC. I mean, is there power here? I'd honestly be surprised. Let's start with that. I'm gonna put my meter leads between R and C and wow. 26.7 volts so the it, we got power at the unit coming down obviously there's a transformer in there from i don't know either 208 down to 24 or 120 down to 24 so we got power coming to the unit there's definitely a transformer transformers working okay so wow i'm surprised let's jump this thing out we got no control i really like these jumpers because they fit right in there and they're magnetic. So I'm gonna jump R to W. All right. Oh man, this thing is working, man. Stop playing with me. The fan started and I heard like a loud sound, like a screeching sound and that screeching sound had to be the actuator. Looks like they only use this for heat. Wow, where is everything? That's gotta be, that was the actuator opening. Man, I don't got have a good space. Let me set my ladder up right. This thing turned on. Everybody, just keep in mind, I'm on a 10 foot ladder. Oh, okay. Oh man, I feel the heat already actually. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I think we found someone's hangout. It's nice and warm in here. I can see why. Ch birds are chilling in here. Oh. Oh God, it's full of bird dropping. Oh no. Oh. We got two eggs, man. They're nesting in here. Oh no. Where's the bird? Oh man, this thing wasn't working. Couldn't, it would have kept these guys 
warm. Oh no. Ah, uh, that's sad. That is sad. So we got two pipes coming in. That's the valve actuator. I feel hot air, so I know that valve actuator open and I heard it too. It's a Siemens actuator. And I feel hot air coming out of here and this is where they were hanging out. It's freaking disgusting in here and sad at the same time. Oh my god. This place is disgusting. I gotta get out of here. Hold up. What they got over here? Look there. That conduit goes down. And so the thermostat's coming up. If you look up top right there, that's the transformer. And then there's a rib re relay there. See the little red light? That's energized. Oh man. Well, this thing freaking works. But this setup though, to just be blowing against the wall there, barely any return there. This cut up filter is not even the right filter. Ooh, packed. All right. Hold on, I need to get down, man. Get the model serial number here. That's the Williams unit. Okay. Oh my lord, guy! It looks doesn't look as much like in the video, but man, there's a lot of stuff here. Bird droppings, sticks. They were nesting in here. What the heck? Someone's fork was here. Who the hell is eating bird droppings over here, man? <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, I just need a thermostat on this thing. They're gonna be all right. Thermostat, a new filter, and a thermostat, a new filter. Clean up that whole area. You know what it is? They leave these. They leave this door open at times. Okay, the guy's doing construction. See? They open this door, and these poor birds come in here, and they start hanging out, and they start creating. Uh, they start nesting in here. But yeah, we just jumped out R and W. So we sent 24 volts to W. And we basically energized the heating circuit telling, hey, we want heat. We did what the thermostat would do, but. This case. There's no screen, no buttons. It's just, the thing is, somebody did this though. Somebody like ripped this off. I don't know, someone didn't get paid or something back in 2022. Sorry, my brother, they pay the bills now. Thank the Lord. That's pretty much as easy as it gets. You know, it is what it is, and it ain't what it ain't. What I'm gonna do is just basically change that thermostat, change the air filter, take some measurements there to see if can we duck that facing down. If we could, it would be nice. I mean, look at this, all these wires hanging from here. What happened here? This is like a damper, this is actuated for the damper. It looks like it's supposed to be pulling fresh air from outside, but even back there, the, the inlet is blocked off, so they don't use this anymore. It is what it is. Oh, hey. Thank you. Yeah, so that's pretty much the plan. New thermostat, program it properly. New air filter. Uh, see if this can be ducted, and that's about it. I would like to change the thermostat for this unit, but we just, we just got hit with a bunch of service calls, so we're gonna wrap this one up here. This is going to be the troubleshooting video. We can make a repair, uh, you know, probably tomorrow. Anyways, we're going to wrap this one up here. If anyone found this video interesting or helpful, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe as we come out with new hack job 
prepares every week. I'll catch you all next time. Thank you.